parents, you better hope the start of school goes smoother than the Shelby County Commission's first meeting in a newly renovated meeting room did. Commissioners, commissioners rather, discussed starting the new school year with COVID-19 in the neighborhood. There was plenty of plexiglass to separate commissioners. The only trouble was that the audio sounded like a pan full of scrambled eggs cooking. Local 24 News reporter Mike Matthews listened to it all and has the details. The vast majority of Shelby County Commissioners showed up in person for this meeting. A few didn't. Maybe they were the lucky ones. Take a look at the coronavirus renovated meeting room. It looks like a liquor store where everything sits behind bulletproof glass. This was plexiglass. Chairman Mark Billingsley says it is time to deal with the fact COVID-19 is going to be around. Schools will have to deal with it. This is an extremely complex situation. Plans will adjust accordingly. The guy with a scrambled-like voice is Shelby County Education Director Dr. Cedric Gray. See, this meeting was a hybrid, some in person, some on the computer. It was the cause of the problem, one everyone hopes will be worked out come school time. A recent national survey of teachers concluded that 42% of teachers prefer a hybrid model for instruction this fall, with the remaining teachers split between distance learning and a full return. Now, parents have the option to choose virtual or in-person learning for their child by July 18th. This year, every student in Shelby County Schools was given a laptop or an iPad. Children learn how to use a computer quickly. Parents don't. Regarding technology and parents, final bullet at the bottom of the learning gap, districts must address parents' varying levels of comfort and provide space for training parents on various learning platforms and devices. They've got an awful lot of work to do. Classes begin August 31st. In Memphis, Mike Matthews, Local 24 News.